Hey guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I will show how to use Null Object. Null Object is a very important tool in After Effects. Let's get started. So friends, welcome back and let's create basic scene. Let's create new solid layer and add name background. Change color white. Click OK and lock layer again create new solid layer add name background 2 and color let's use yellow click ok and let's change scale and move to down ok let's lock layer again create new solid layer add name cube and change color to red click ok and change scale and let's move to here okay right now let's select this cube and press p make new passing keyframe and go to 10 keyframe for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down in chamber and let's move to up go to 10 keyframe again select first keyframe let's copy pass select this keyframe so let's make easy or click f9 okay let's see so let's select work area like this and select three frames go to graph editor select this graph let's move to left and this graph move right for falling cube okay so back to three frames and right now let's right mouse new and null object for move to anchor point center hold control double click this icon click station tool and let's move to here move to put like this okay in this time select this cube let's link to null object and select this null go to last shape frame let's press air open rotation and let's make rotation shape frame go to 3 shape frame for shortcut you can use page down or click here write plus 3 for go to 3 shape frame click ok and change rotation 4 and go to 3 keyframe, change 0. Select keyframes, let's make easy. Let's say animation. Okay, nice. So we can add other null objects. For example, let's create new null object again. Move to anchor point center, hold control, double click here, clearization tool, and let's move to here. Okay, and select this null 2, let's link to null 3. Select null 3, and let's press R, make rotation keyframe, and go to 10 keyframe, change rotation like this. Let's change minus 90. And select keyframes, let's make easy. Let's see. Nice. So right now let's create again null object. Hold control, double click this icon, click station tool, and let's move to here. And select this null 3, let's link to null 4. And in this time, let's select null 4, press air, open rotation, make rotate keyframe and go to 3 keyframe, 1 to 3, change minus 4. Go to 3 keyframe, 1 to 3, change 0. Say keyframes, make easy. Let's say animation. Nice. Okay, so select these null objects 3 keyframes, go to graph editor, and let's play with graphs. Select this graph, let's move to left. Let's see this part. Or let's move to right, change graph like this. Okay, back to keyframes and select this keyframe. Let's move to left. Okay, that's good. And let's change rotation minus eight. Nice, very good. Let's do full animation. 
Okay, not bad. So friends, right now I will show how to move all objects with no objects. Let's first select this background and Ctrl D for duplicate, change scale. And let's go to FX Presses, search FX Fill. Let's use Fill for change color. And let's change color like this. Click OK. Move to left. And let's change name Cube 1. And let's Ctrl D this cube. Move right. And change color red. Okay, basically I want to move the all objects to down. Let's select these cubes, press P, make new position keyframe, go to 3 seconds and move to down. Okay, but this is not a good way. Let's control Z and close all positions. Then let's right mouse new and null object. And hold control, double click palm behind icon for move to anchor point center. Click session 2. Select this cube 2 and cube 1. Let's link to null object. Select null object, let's press P, make new passing keyframe, and go to 6 seconds. Move to down. Let's see. Okay, very easy. Also, I can add here new objects, for example, ellipse 2, like this. Let's close stroke width, open fill color. And I can select shape layer, let's link to null object, let's see, very nice. And also let's add star. And link to null 5, let's see. Okay, very easy and very fast. So friends, I have 6 icons and I want to make rotate animations. Let's first enable title action save and create new null object okay move to here hold control double click palm behind icon click session 2 and let's put center here like this okay so in this time let's go to shape layers hold this icon select ellipse 2 and hold shift make one ellipse move to center and close inside color go to fill select none click ok and go to circle, let's change red. Okay, and move to behind here. Then let's select this icon, let's move to here, and this move to here, and this, this, like this, okay. Nice. And delete shape layer, select all icons, let's link to null object. And select this null, let's press R, make rotation keyframe, and go to. 6 second chain rotation like this let's see okay that's good and go to first second select these all layers press air make rotation keyframe and go to last second and let's change all rotations 180 let's see nice very good For example, let's go to shape layers and hold this icon. Let's create rectangle tool and make one rectangle like this. Click session two, then open rectangle one and rectangle pet one. And let's right mouse click convert to bezel pet. Then select this pet one, open inside, select this pet. Then go to window and open create news from pet. Okay, first click pet and go to click points full of nulls. Nice, let's close window. And right now we have four null objects for control this shape layer. Let's see. Okay, very nice. I can make keyframes for these nulls. For example, let's select these all nulls, go to first second, press P and make new passing keyframe, go to here. Let's change nulls like this. Let's see. Nice. So friends, right now I will show how to rig character with new objects. So first take body, let's go to solo and go to puppet pin. Let's add one puppet here. 
one here and one here. If you not see this mesh, go to click show icon, like this. Ok, let's click here for close mesh and click session 2 and let's open puppet here, mesh 1 and deforms, let's see, this is which, ok, this is pin 3, this is pin 1, pin 2 and pin 3. Ok, let's go to layer, new and null object. Hold control and click here for move to anchor point, center, click session 2 and move to here. Let's change null name 1 and let's control D, move to down. This is 2 and control D, move to down, this is null 3. Ok. So right now let's select this body, press U for see only deform chair frames and I will use expression for rigging. Let's go to here and let's copy this expression code. I will share this code in the description below. Ok, after copy this code, let's go to pin 1 and hold ALT, click this time icon. Ctrl V for paste and click this icon for move to up and change null layer name 1. And click here for done expression. Let's select this null 1. Let's see. Nice, that's good. And let's make someone for puppet pin 2. Hold ALT, click this time icon. And Ctrl V, go to up, change null layer name, 2. Click here for done expression. Select null 2, let's see. Nice, very good. And finally, puppet pin 3. Hold Alt, click again here for open expression and Ctrl V, go to up, change null layer name, 3. Click here and close body key frames and unsolo all layers and let's see select 3 nice very good so in this time let's select this glass and I close eyeball eyes and mods up down let's link to null object 1 and select up also link to null object 1 select null object 1 let's see very good Let's see full screen. Okay, very nice. I like it. And change this and this. So friend, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.